everyone. Uh, I am Dr. Sachin Patel. I am a full time consultant neurosurgeon at Krishna Selby Hospital, Ahmedabad. Uh, today I am going to talk about stereotactic biopsy. Uh, so, first of all, what is stereotactic biopsy? Uh, stereotactic biopsy it is a minimal invasive procedure uh, which involves obtaining the small amount of the abnormal brain tissue from the deeper areas of the brain without damaging the other vital and critical areas. Then uh, next question will be why stereotactic biopsy? When the lesion is located in the deeper areas of the brain, whatever may be the lesion, it can be brain tumor, abscess or demyelination. So if we want to take out that tissue uh, without damaging the other vital areas, if we do it by conventional method, by open surgery, then there is a higher risk of uh, post-operative neurodeficit as the lesion is located in the deeper areas. So in stereotactic biopsy, what we do? Uh, we obtain the tissue through only small burr hole by passing the needle through it. So that is the main advantage of stereotactic biopsy. Uh, then next question will be how is it performed? So there are two ways we can perform it. First is uh, stere uh, frame based stereotactic biopsy and second is frame based stereotactic biopsy. So in frame based stereotactic biopsy, we need to fit the stereotactic frame on patient's head. There are various frames available in market uh, like Lexel frame, CRW frame. So after the frame is fixed under the local anesthesia, then after the patient, after that patient is shifted to CT scan room, and CT scan is being done while the frame is still on the patient's head, and we obtain the X, Y, Z coordinates with help of the uh, CT scan machine software and the special formula. After that, patient is shifted back to operation theater and uh, we adjust those uh, obtained previously obtained coordinates xyz coordinates into the frame and then we make the burr hole on the patient's skull and we pass the needle through it to obtain that tissue then the second technique is a frameless stereotactic biopsy uh, it's a image guided uh, neuro navigation uh, technique in which we use the stealth station Actually, it's most commonly we use of Matronix and various other companies' neural navigation system is also available. So, in this case, uh, we need to, uh, first of all, we need to uh, uh, save the previously done CT scan or MRI data into the navigation system. After that, we register the patient into the navigation system uh, with help of virtual probe, uh, infrared and electromagnetic uh, waves, which comes in within the that. Uh, navigation system so after registration the next procedure will be the same we do the burr hole and then we pass the needle through it uh, that procedure will be the same so what is the difference between two techniques uh, both are equally good and uh, there are minimal chances of error in that uh, but in case of image guided second one image guided or frameless stereotactic biopsy uh, there is no need to fix the frame on the patient's head and uh, it gives the real-time images of procedure in, into the monitor so we can see the where the needle is going inside the brain parenchyma so that is the main advantage after obtaining that tissue we send it to the pathologist and uh, after four to five days pathologist uh, provides the final histopathological uh, examination report and it gives us information about the uh, uh, what was that lesion? Means, uh, is it a weather brain tumor, brain abscess, or demyelination? If it is, if it is a brain tumor, then uh, what what is the type of the tumor? What is the grade of the tumor? Uh, all information will be provided in that report. So, depending on that, we will plan the further line of treatment. Thank you.